All right, Google Ads Agency Academy Part 11. Just some basic vocab here, right? Overall, nothing too complex. Won't be walking through any very complex topics yet. Um, just some actual you know, terms that you should know if you're gonna be going through this course and what I mean when we talk about this, right? So an impression is kind of each time your ad is shown and these are free in search. Click is when someone clicks in your ad, you know, this could be the text, this could be an asset, right? Or they used to be called extensions. And you only get charged for these on the on the search side. Your click through rate is clicks by about about impressions. This tells you how well your keywords and ad copy are, are performing, aka relevancy, right? All of the relevance. The example here is you have five clicks of 100 impressions, would be 5% click through rate. You usually want to shoot for at least 5% of the cold side. Honestly, I like to have eight to 10 if possible. Um, you're going to hear like the word or the average, like one to 3% toss around. Maybe on the very broad side on the shopping, maybe. But one to 3% on a cold search is pretty bad. Uh, you want to try to get at least five. But at the end of the day, it could also be a strategy where you want to get as less clicks, at least clicks as possible if you're really trying to force your clicks to be really qualified. For example, if you're selling a really expensive, uh, you know, info product or e-commerce product or service and you don't want to have people shopping around and wasting your ad money, especially in very competitive search uh, kind of industries, then you may want, you know, one to 2% click through rate because you only want the most qualified people ready to buy actually, you know, ready to click on your ad. So it could always be a strategy, just usually on the most of the time, five, five plus percent is where you want to be at. CPC or cost per click is the price you pay per click. Usually your actual CPC will be less than your max bid if you're doing manual stuff, because um, you only have to pay what's required to win the auction as the next competitor at their LTV score, or otherwise known as the ad score. Cold keywords are keywords that do not contain your brand or your brand and product or service names. For example, if I, if you typed in, if I wanted to target, you know, Google Ads Management is a keyword that would be a cold uh, search term if they got that. A brand keyword would be a keyword that contains your brand name or branded product service name. For example, if I target, targeted uh, Schmell PPC Management and wanted Schmell PPC in that search term, that would be a branded keyword, right? Makes sense. Your max bid is a maximum you're willing to pay for clicking your ad. And then the last two things are impression share, which is the percentage of, it, of impressions your ads receive compared to the total number of impressions your ads could get, right? This is the only competitive tracked one. So if you're not competitive to be in that auction, then it's not gonna be tracked. An example would be 50% impression share. That means you're showing up for five to 10 searches possible. You have another 50% of searches that you're not showing up for, either due to ad rank or your budget is out, is out of the budget. And how does this work? Google estimate the total impression share by looking at all ad, ad auctions daily, then using internal data, aka quality components, kind of give you that number around. And if less than 10%, you get less than 10%, you don't get an actual number at that point. Then click share is uh, estimated share of all achievable clicks that you could have received. Um, this is PMAX search and shopping only, no display um, and no video for that one or uh, demand gen as of now. Um, example, you've received 60 clicks or a 60% click share. An estimation shows you could have received another 40 clicks if you had more assets, higher bids, higher budgets, more products eligible, etc. And then even if you have high impression share, your click share can still be low, right? If you have lower click through rate and stuff like that. So again, easy vocab. Just want to run through that just so you kind of understand what I'm talking about in the following uh, videos.